protect protect myself from the discipline protect myself from the discipline from my mom disciplining me but when i uh tried when i tried kicking the door with my feet um it it it, it broke and my mom got mad at me so you 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 can change the fact that i was being disciplined I was being disciplined because even Child Protective said I was. So when I first started looking at my wall, you can see the wall is broken. It's been damaged and I do break things when I'm mad. The only simple that discipline is so bad because you actually did something bad that got you disciplined or punished. Have you ever heard someone say, if you leave your child being punished all along, it is abusive and you could be abusing someone. That's how we start to look at the third party, that discipline is just not a joke, man. I got to do the videos to take stuff serious because um, we don't want to discipline. Instead, we want to go to we want to go and learn about God. That's how Jesus Christ began to came in my heart. Soon after I was getting disciplined. Now think about it. Discipline ain't a joke. That's why I'm doing like a really long thing to show you that it ain't a joke. Discipline ain't nothing to mess around with. Discipline ain't a joke. You know that discipline is not a joke. Because you ha I have been dis I have been being disciplined as right now. As right now. I have been being disciplined. Can you tell me how I have been? Yeah, you know how I have been disciplined over the over all day from morning from morning time and night time. Well, anyways, um, I had to, um, I had to do I had to do something that was gonna um help me express my anger without using profanity. You know what this was? You know what that is? It is a video I'm doing right now. I'm not using profanity yet, but I can say um being disciplined and doing anything bad is not anything to fuck around with cuz it is fucking around with Satan. It is fucking around with the devil. So don't play, don't play around in your life or thinking that you're not going to get disciplined. Hell yeah, you are because I did something bad and you said profanity out loud when um, you was caught for that. After how many times I have been spanked, not even spanked, but I did reveal that we're giving kids presents. So you could think of this stuff. You could actually pretend presents. You like your mom doesn't reward you for bad behavior, but there are ways to help you be good. There are things that might make you happy. Actually, you can go to school. You can go to Strong Hospital. You can go to your visits and see Big Henry. You could be anywhere to help you. You could be anywhere no matter how happy you are. That is why it is bad to be mad. It is nasty to um do bad stuff. And most of it is like using profanity. But you get the profanity, yes or no? Because I have once in a time said, I have once never in my life, I have once never in my life said that I wasn't going to get disciplined because everybody did got disciplined. Everybody got disciplined. Discipline was cool. We, we know discipline was a core punishment that's going to make people's life worse. But I still got it. Rather, if I liked it or not, I still got disciplined. For some reason, I still got disciplined. You know why I got disciplined? Because I was doing something bad. And as you could go down, and as you could go downstairs, you could see mommy right now. But I'm not gonna do it. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna go all the way quietly, 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 quietly go down there. So. As I can see, I'm not going to record her, but I'm going to show her. Okay, I'm not going to do anything to her. I'm not going to do anything. 
I just gotta see what's on my thing. Just gotta see. Is there any clue what this is going to happen? No, there's not. So, just how it begins. So, sorry. Anybody that um, anybody that doesn't get rewarded for bad behavior needs consequences to help them express their actions instead of cursing, cussing, and using profanity. Maybe it's the profanity that got me breaking things. Not just profanity has, but it's, there's other things. There's like breaking stuff. You know, breaking stuff. Like, you have to delete the negative thoughts or you have to basically reset your brain. Do you know the only way you're gonna avoid discipline? You gotta actually learn how you're gonna you're gonna be a you're gonna have to reset your brain or restart your brain. I don't know if the mind or the human brain is like a computer or is actually a computer, but I believe the brain is a computer because I can use it more better to help me avoid discipline by Downloading programs or software to help me express my anger, remove my anger, and get God in my life. To re help me express my anger and remove my anger and delete all of the bad stuff that is online. It's to help me move, remove my anger. It's to help me express my anger. It's also to help me delete and erase all of the bad anger, thoughts, bad negative stuff. It is also to delete and remove negative thoughts. When I wrote ways to deal with your anger, isn't that a way to delete doing something bad or delete being mad? Yes, it was because breaking stuff, the hole in the wall stood there. It wasn't deleted as the only way you would have to repair it, but you can't delete it. You you could paint it and it will still be fixed. So, is there any expression that I'm trying to do that video just to remind people to tell them I'm going to be good and I'm not going to ever keep my negativity. I'm not going to ever have my negativity being restored into my brain like a um backup. That's what I'm here to talk about. Deleting a bunch of negativity that nobody is allowed to have, even on TV or on the radio or on YouTube. Much, most of all, the brain is like, most of all, the brain usually is like, acts like a computer, but you could delete negative thoughts. You can pr pretend you have a, you can imagine you ha are, you can imagine you are a computer. You can imagine that you have a flag button in your head, or you can imagine you have a delete button in your head. This, like a computer, this could be like deleting all of the bad negative thoughts that you have uploaded into your brain, that you have uploaded into your brain, that you have uploaded into your computer right here. If you don't delete all of the bad thoughts, your Henry computer system called your brain can overact and respond. Or get viruses or crash or destroy or even have other negative thoughts uploaded, filtered like as inappropriate YouTube comments. So anybody guys, if I delete Satan's bad thoughts or remove Satan's video, then I could. My mom already removed Satan's video. Because it, the, the, because maybe the devil might have uploaded it, and I don't know who uploaded that. I uploaded that to my channel, to my YouTube channel, and I was mad. But that would mean the only somebody else it would be is the devil. When you're mad or when you're bad, it would be the devil uploading bad videos. But when you're good or happy, it would be God uploading those good videos to YouTube. It, and that means you're not God, or, it mean, or if you're bad, that means you are you are the bad. So, when I try to stay away from the um, the devil, I try to step in God's. I try to step in God so that I don't get attacked or get choke slammed, pushed, abused, abused, 
or touched on sexually. That's how I had to stop all that right now because I was thinking of if revulsion were, if if you had, if I, I was thinking of if you had your privileges revoked forever, it would be abused. If you'd be punished for a long time, it would be abused. It would be abusive, abuse. So anyways, hopefully I can avoid this corporal punishment. Hopefully I can avoid this abuse. Hopefully I can avoid this type of physical punishment, type of corporal punishment, and type of legal discipline, and type of illegal stuff. I can try to avoid this kind of corporal punishment, but revulsion, it is true that you can get a butt spanking with your, when you're bad, but doesn't mean revulsion is a cruel of punishment. Well, it doesn't mean that. It just means you're. Di it just means they're trying to discipline you. But I'm right now worried about staying away from that stuff. Staying away from that stuff. Maybe it could get me out of trouble if I don't break stuff or hurt people. That's why I did that video. So. Um, you guys, today, I'm going to make sure I get myself together and do good as fast as I can because it's not a joke. Rather, if you're being corporal punished or not, legal discipline or, or illegal, it still is going to happen. So, you know that. They know that. You know it's going to happen. That's why.